beautiful. <laughs> really. And I mean it. It's one of the nicest looking and also, uh, I don't know, it's, a, it's quite a large hall, but somehow it has a feel, feeling of uh, intimacy in it. You come on the stage and you feel at home somehow. You feel uh, the relationship with the public and so forth very, very, um, very posh, very near somehow, yeah. Viotti. Yes, I remember very well. Well, it was very interesting because they, there was a series of concerts organized at a base at your hall, maybe, uh, about uh, a concerto, uh, one of the great concertos, in relation with some work of a um, um, uh, near period of the same time as the concerto, the great concerto. And played the Be Beethoven concerto and Viotti concerto. I mean, these two concertos, Viotti a little earlier, were written and played for the first time uh, over 200 years ago now. And uh, a big hall at that time would have been uh, three, four, five hundred maximum. But in the Suntory Hall, well, there are two thousand or more. And uh, somehow the Suntory Hall has kept, in spite of its larger, this kind of intimacy, feeling of nearness, for which these concertos were written. We played these concertos 200 years ago in bigger halls. I mean, if you, you know, if, if you think that you play in, in the Albert Hall uh, uh, in, in London, you know, this enormous uh, thing, uh, you know, but it's also, funnily enough, a place where, depends where you sit, you, uh, you, you have a certain form of intimacy, and when you play on the stage, of the Albert Hall, you feel very, very comfortable. Well, first of all, I wish to the Santory San 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 Hall uh, uh, many, many, many more birthdays. <laughs> and that uh, I don't know whether the effect of how much music and sounds go and uh, repeat and, and change in a hall like that whether the walls around it, the seats get impregnated with the residues of what, well, not everything even that one hears here, but probably yes, in some way or another. And all the history, all the millions and millions of notes, crescendos and diminuendos, piano, pianissimo, and forte and fortissimo, all that all will resound like that and grow into much more like that. And I wish it, uh, a long life and a long happy life in relation to the people who come and sit and listen and the people who play and all of this becoming one beautiful symphony called Santory Hall. Mm -hmm.